Hey, I'm Rick from EssentialPhotoshopElements.com. In this video, we're going to see how easy Photoshop Elements 9 has made it to create the Lomo effect using your own photos. For anyone that doesn't know, Lomo is a brand of camera that takes photographs with an unusual look to them. They tend to have lots of contrast and sometimes unusual color. This is the desired result of the photo and they have attracted quite a fan base of photographers. In Elements 9 you can quickly and easily simulate the look with the Lomo camera effect located under the new Fun Edits category. So first click on the Edit tab and then click Guided and go down under Fun Effects and you'll see the first effect is the Lomo camera effect. So click on that and you'll see the two-step process. Click the first button, which is called the Cross Process Image button. I'll click that once and you'll see the results in your image. Notice right under the button it says click again to intensify the effect. So I'm going to click again. That may be a bit strong, but let's leave it at that for now. And let's go down to the next button which says apply vignette and I'll click that once and click it again to intensify it and maybe even click it a third time and that's the effect it looks kinda cool but I want to show you another option if you click on the full edit button that brings you into full edit mode now you can see in the layers palette that elements has added two new layers the first layer is the first time we clicked on the cross process image button and the second layer shows the results after we clicked on it again and then click the apply vignette button. So now if I lower the opacity of the top layer by dragging the opacity slider over to the left it lessens the effect. And if I bring it right down to 50 percent it gives me an intensity right between the first time I clicked and the second time. So there's a little tip on how you can have some control over the results. I hope you enjoyed this video. To see lots more information on Photoshop Elements, visit my website at EssentialPhotoshopElements.com. Until next time, take care.